Welcome back to another episode of Talking Nerdy. This is the Nerdy Bits Rapid Fire Questions with Rapid Fire Answers. And today's topic is retro games versus new games. Modern AAA titles. Which one's better? And I say new games. And you're pro- I do like old games. Like old games? Would you like to start this one? I'm sorry that you like old games. Mm-hmm. Uh, new games, dude, I got I to gotta give it to them. I mean, there are, there's a time and a place for old games, but new ones just keep coming out. Heavy hitters, new AAA titles, constantly pushing the envelope forward. When you're talking about like uh, more shaders, uh, ray tracing, I mean, the technologies have just been pushed by NVIDIA and AMD to, to just one-up each other. And because of that, we're getting cinematic level games uh you know with every every launch and whatnot especially every new console every iteration of a graphics card for pc and whatnot but games dude i I gotta give it to new ones because you have massive franchises like call of duty everybody's played it everybody loves it god of war gears of war assassin's creed valhalla uh i mean the storytelling in them is just something that you really can't do with a uh, 2d linear style game you cannot t- storytell like you can today. Uh, and then if you're not really into storytelling, you can have a massive uh, multiplayer experience like World of Warcraft, Grand Theft Auto. I mean, there's literally a game now for everybody's fancy, and uh, new games are just dominating. I agree with some parts of your aspect, but not all of it. So when you talk about like World of Warcraft, I played World of Warcraft, but I play it the vintage style 15 <laughs> years ago. So. Okay. Yes. So if so, just let's just do World of Warcraft for an example. Okay, it's 15 example. years old. No, great example. First <laughs> off, 15 years old, and people still play it. A big. So instead of playing the new World of Warcraft, there's more people playing the old World of Warcraft. Okay. Case in point, it's not as good graphics. I agree, but it's the nostalgia of it. Nostalgic. I can't even say anything on that because I was playing the old one with yeah, you. Exactly. So the nostalgic of it. Um, Call of Duty, whatever. They're all the same. Deal with that one. Um, <clears throat> just let's play zombies. Attack him. Yeah. Yep. Whatever. <laughs> um, so, yeah. So, um, like Mario. I love Mario's. But name the last good Mario game. Mario game? Yeah. Uh, I can't tell you the last good Mario yeah, game. Yeah, me neither. Well, so if you're talking Mario, because Mario's old school. Mario's is so old school. Mario 64. You know, awesome. Right. Old school games. Nothing new. So old titles don't necessarily translate well i, I agree no because the graphics and all yeah. that fun stuff but like what about zelda like i've tried the new zeldas they're they're fun but they're not like the same nostalgic so yes they have better graphics i agree that's not an argument that's fact right but the the nostalgic of it and just the feel and the flow i feel like you can pick it up after 10 years of not playing still remember and still play it through completely I'm not saying they're not better but i'm saying you need them and it's just they're fun to play you know donkey kong you ever played donkey kong 3 yeah oh yeah on oh, yeah. Su- super nintendo yeah get out of here yeah i mean there's time and a place and, and the nice thing about old school games retro games is that literally any anybody can pick it up and play like yes. said, like a kid or whatever uh but i do like a challenge and i want to constantly be challenged okay the shows i watch the books i read everything needs to get my brain thinking my motor skills going and mm-hmm. i think the new AAA titles are what do it not everybody can play it and if you walk away from it for too long, you do kind of need to rebrush up. And I think it's kind of good for, you know, uh, just the brain and everything, motor skills and whatnot. But uh, I do have an argument because you brought up Mario. Um, yeah, no, Mario isn't good today. Okay, perfect. like the new ones that they're coming out with. But I don't think I don't think you can keep making these old games in this new world because there's a reason why people loved them, and it's for the simplicity. Mm-hmm. They were good then. They don't translate well today. Just like if you were to make a new like gears of war into a retro game i don't think anybody's gonna no, like I, that. I agree right? no i agree I, I just think there's aspects on both sides that are good i just think don't say that all retro games are bad <laughs> <laughs> like i you know and all all new games are good sure I think there's a lot of crap i think there's a lot more crap out there now than there was back in the day yeah but i mean oh, 100 agree to yeah. disagree i but yeah I, I see what you're saying i see what i'm saying um uh, i just couldn't I'm good with the simple games, simple mind for simple games for simple minds. <laughs> simple Jack Never mind. over here. That's no, no, wrong. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I yeah, I, I just I prefer the simple games that can just pick up any time and go with it and not have to be on the leaderboards all the time, you know, grinding for 10 hours a day just to be on the top 1000 in the in the in the state. the competitiveness yeah. of it. Yeah, right? Yeah, I mean, that's why And there's no rage monsters. There's no rage monsters with Zelda. There's back nobody in the day. talking smack in There's the lobby. There's no one talking stuff. smack in the lobby. No one <laughs> saying you're telling your kids you can't go in the lobby because of the cuss words and stuff like that. So you don't, 
This is before that stuff. So. Safe for all ages. Safe for all ages. Ah, uh, well, what do you what do you think about this? Do you prefer retro games or do you like the new AAA titles that are coming out today? Sound off down below in the comments. Let us know what you thought, and we will see you guys in the next nerdy bits. Peace.